Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Resolution and welcome back to Cult of the Lamb. Now, there are a lot of things going on in the background besides these guys, but uh, I have been doing a few little upkeep things here and there in the background just so that the videos progress along. You don't want to see me... Oh, hello. Nope, wrong guy. Um, you don't want to see me collecting faith, harvesting plants, Chasing spiders, or wisp, or this, or just simply planning out where my buildings should be. Like, I'm doing a lot of this in the background, and it kind of pays off, really. I need to move that scarecrow. Or sending Kale Salad to jail, for example, in prison. I'm doing this for a quest, by the way. So I am going to focus my efforts more on the actual gameplay, as in going dungeon delving, Probably a little bit of base building, a little bit. Why aren't you guys using the bathroom? God damn it all to heck. Uh, buffalo wings, come here. Thank you for your juices. Anyways, let's collect the reward from Sonic and keep going with this uh, particular run. Come on. Give me, give me my stuff. Lovely. Thank you for keeping us safe. Thank you. Now we can release Kale Salad. There you go. You've been re-educated and released. That's perfect. Anywho, we've got two farms going now. I'm, I'm just going to give you the rundown, right? We've got two farms going. We've got lots of things happening. We've got a shit ton of seeds and poop. And life is good. Life is good. Life is really good. But we need to complete the dungeon. Ooh. So a lot of the basic resource stuff, like, for example, building or at least queuing up all these uh, resource generating buildings, maybe doing the basic sermons like what I'm doing now. I'll probably skip most of that. I'll probably cut down short. If you've seen the last few videos, there are a few edits, there are a few cuts. And uh, that's, that's all on done on purpose just basically get the game sped along a little bit Ooh, hello but things like this where i start choosing doctrines and stuff i might just keep them in because they are interesting they are genuinely interesting uh let's just get kudai's blessing i guess we're going to get all of them in anyways eventually fervor of the righteous uh more curses or zealous weapons let's just get kudai's blessing Dunskis. Just kind of want to finish that. Oh, and we unlock the next tier. Brilliant. Ah, nice. We've also got rituals that we can cast. Marriage. But we're pretty high on faith at the moment. We've got doctrines. We've got lots of doctrines. Holy crap. We've got stuff that we've done, right? We've got stuff. So, anyways. We caught some of them dancing. That's lucky. Ooh, hot dog's happy. And has given me all his uh, special juices. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, anywho, while the base is running relatively autonomously, we're gonna go back into the dungeon. Let's first get someone maybe uh, with half a spirit heart, targets random enemies and explodes let's go with mr potato sounds like we're gonna make a potato bomb of some sort convert potato you shall be for lovely let's head back into the dungeon so there's things like fishing which i also haven't done as of yet or lately Hasn't really been a problem with food. I can always make berry bushes or berry dishes or grassy gruel if need be. Ooh, Vampiric Dagger 7. Grab that for now. Maybe a touch of Teruwa. And as some of you mentioned, I should probably use my curses more often, right? Because Fervor kind of regenerates whenever you kill enemies. And like... And like some of the curses are genuinely quite powerful. I should really be using them, but I keep forgetting. Look, I've got short term memory span. Oh crap, what the heck? Eh. 
in this case, I've used my cursor. So, right, I've got one left. Easy peasy. Cut the grassy. But anyways, most of the actual combat, like in-game combat like this, I probably won't cut. Actually, no. You know what? Cutting all this grass, I probably will cut. Just because no one really wants to see me cutting grass. If you know what I mean. Oh, what the heck is this place? Please don't hurt us. We are simple followers lost in an unfamiliar place. The great Sozo sent us to find more of his beloved menticide mushrooms. He cares only for mushrooms. His madness grows. But when we arrive, we realize we don't know how to find menticide mushrooms. And now we are too afraid to return empty handed. If you were to bring menticide mushrooms, he would certainly reward you. We, you will find him at the Spore Grotto. Oh, is that a new look? There is a new location. Oh, that is... That is looking quite weird. Oh. Did my demon just explode in one of these guys? All right, we're not getting anything from these guys. That's... Un oh, I stand corrected. We got mushrooms. Um, So let's go south. I think there's something here. Oh, hello there, Clonic. So I'm going to try skip as many things as possible, all the boring bits at least. But things like this, I'll probably keep. Um, I'll probably keep it them as is. Chess, better chess. Why not? Can't say no to a good chess, can you? <laughs> but there are a lot of things, and it does. If I do that, it does increase my uh, editing time. Which I am sorry if it takes longer to edit. You know what? No, I'm not sorry at all. This is this is my doing. This is my choice. It is my choice to play this game, and it's my choice to display it however I, I want. Oh. Hello. Five points to a pentagram, five portents of doom, five siblings to the breast, five gods, and one tomb. What are we? Dr. Seuss? She Shamura. Shamura, we do not wish to bother you, but... Shamura, the red crown grew stronger by today. Already has succeeded where he has failed before. Lest he has been slain. Five becomes four, becomes three, becomes two, becomes one, becomes nothing. Shamura, rest. We will deal with this, won't we, Kalamar? Yes, sister, of course. How can you tell if they're ladies or gentlemen, if they've got the wee-wee or no wee-wee, they've got the other uh, wee-wee, the, the opposite of wee-wee. Do the vessel of the red crown. Bow to me or you will regret it. I refuse. You are barrel, I will make you. Oh, oh. Whew. Um, do I have, do I have another choice now? Can I go back and like <laughs> change my choice? It's become all fight. What? Oh God, what are you? What are you? And I'm not sorry. I've got to kill, I've got to kill you now. Need somebody and always. I'm kidding, guys. I'm a terrible singer. I'm sorry I had to subject you to that. What is this? Receive double the health when healing. Okay, that's not too bad if we could only heal. We've got blue hearts. That doesn't do any good to anyone. Ow. Ow, these things that let out the other things, they are bad. They are very bad and very painful. Okay, did we get any much? We got coins. Coins are good, right? Coins are really good. And we've only got one way to go, which is up. Of course, we've got to destroy everything. It's a game. It's an exploratory game. We've got to destroy everything in order to increase our chances of getting good stuff. Look at that. 15 coins. We've got 39 coins now. What do we have? We had two. We had two coins. All right. Looks like that gives us heart. That gives us heart. Sorry, that gives us heart. We go here. We go as far west as we can because life is peaceful in the west. Hello. But first, let's steal them friendly yogurt juices. Uh, the, fr the friendly uh, organic yogurt. Well, old yogurt's organic if you really think about it. What do we have now? Ica Throne. Okay. Necromantic Gauntlet. Ooh, more damage. Vampiric Axe. Ooh. 
is the... Hang on. No, the gauntlet's faster, it does more damage. I say we do take the gauntlet. As much as I do not like the gauntlet, the dagger doesn't have much of a reach. So I think trying out the gauntlet is probably the best. I've, I've completely ignored what he said. Thanks, Kudai. There you go. Yeah, we got there in the end. But yeah, killing dummies is such a pain in the ass. Off to these, we destroy the Ani. They're very, uh... They're, they're very anal about getting things right. We've only got one way to go, which is down. The bombs are great, right? Look at that. That was just amazing. You, you hurt the guy a little bit. Destroys the bomb. Like, destroys the entire guy for you. We should pick this the, this bomb demon last time around. 10% chance to deal a critical hit. That's always great news. Do we want to go down or do we want to go left? I think the left sounds good. No, left could have been bad. Okay, at the very least... Oh god, there's so many butt flies. The flies look like butts. Ow. Wait, do we get a ghost every time we kill something? I think we kind of do. Anywho, uh, let's clean up the area again because apparently that's what we do, right? We, we collect more grass because we feed our people grass. Flower Arch, that looks nice. It's a decoration to, ooh, only uses grass. Heck, we might be able to use that. Make some people happy. Keep the faith alive, you know what I mean. Uh, let's also go back and have a look at what's down this way. I wish, kind of wish they gave you like a little glimpse. Oh, they kind of do really. They give you a little glimpse as to what the next area is all about. It isn't much of a glimpse, like claw neck you can tell, they hang stars and moons from the ceiling or whatever. The armory, yes, they'll, they'll, they'll hang uh, swords and stuff. But this guy... Haro. He was unlike the rest of his kin. For the others dealt with flux, chaos, famine, pestilence, war. Things in which their constancy, constancy must transpose. And yet he was the inevitable, the obstinate, the irresistible, the one who waits. Truly peculiar. Would then seem his appetency to invite the novel and the new break ancient vow and primordial born alike. Traditions stagnate and appetites augment nonetheless. Dab tears faith asunder. Oh, goodbye, my friends. I don't know what you're all about, but I'm hoping one day your poems or your stanzas, whatever you want to call them, would make sense to me. Come on. Okay, one more butt plug go. There you go, that's all done. Three coins, is that it? What a waste of my time. Alright, this looks like the end. Yeah, that is the end. Lovely, we've completed one more step. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> we still got the big bad boss at the end. I keep forgetting about the big bad boss. Oh, hello, another statue. Enemies health half, but receive double damage. Hang on, when was this a thing? When did they start? Adding, like, has that always been there? All the buffs and debuffs? Genuinely, someone, someone tell me, has it always been there? I, I, I genuinely want to know, because I, I think I might have missed it this entire time. Man, those ghosties, they don't go far, do they? Okay, we've got nearly everyone now. Just this one more frogster. Good job. Frogster's down. 15 coin. No, not hot dog. Hot dog has died. I've never met a hot dog that, that, that you know, dies of old age. Normally you can keep hot dogs forever. Oh. Let's use a bit of our curse magic. Look at that. What the heck? Oh. Oh, we're, 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 we've got tentacles, guys. We're, we've got tentacles abound. Hang on. 
more importantly, I want why isn't this dropping stone? That's 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 peculiar. That's really peculiar. Okay. Teruos tentacle. Spawns a tentacle that inflicts damage when touched. We have Squidward. Ladies and gentlemen, we have received the Squidward. Uh, north or west? West. Life is people in the west. But we've got Squidward now. What the heck is this? Oh, crap. I've just realized our health is so low. Like, we've lost half a health. And if you recall, we can't actually heal. If you recall, because we're using this blue cape heart thingy, we can't actually genuinely heal, which is going to be a problem, which is going to be a big problem, right? All right, that doesn't seem like the way to go. This might be the way to go. Oh, Klonik. Glad we came here. I kind of want to get more grass for just for grassy gruel, but I know we've got enough food. Draw a card. Attack rate increase or overall weapon damage increase? Oh, they're about the same thing. I think attack rate increase would probably be the best. That has a slightly higher multiplier. Uh, you know, multiplier is multiplier, right? So you go for the slightly higher multiplier because they do, you know, attack speed does more damage in the long run. Now, a 0 0.05 attack speed does more damage than a 0.2 damage increase. Oh, that nearly fell on me. Okay, we've got bones. We've got a lot of shit ton of bones. Actually, we've got, we've got genuinely a shit ton of bones to do any sort of ritual back in the cult. Has our damage gone up? Feels like our damage has gone up. Oh boy. I've just realized we've got less than three hearts left. I kind of wish something would give us hearts right about now. Uh, let's clear out the stones, the grass, whatever. Two seconds of invincibility. Invincibility, hey! We had this last time and it worked pretty well. So let's take that again this time. We don't really use... We don't really use our curse as much, but at least with invincibility, I don't have to aim. A quiet mosaic flooring. Perfectly placed patterns. Lovely, another bit of flooring. We've nearly got all the flooring, all the path pathways. I wonder if anyone's truly at 100% of the game, like got every single collectible. If someone has, if someone has got every single collectible for the game, please let me know. I am, I'm truly interested to hearing how you've come across that and why, what made you do that? Because it seems like such a, such a, such a, I'm not going to say a waste of time. It's, it's a great use of your time. But such seems like such a massive, massive time investment, right? Massive time investment. I love the game. Don't get me wrong. The game's amazing. Uh, these are both not great. Eh, I'll leave it as is. Um, the, the game's amazing, but that's such a, a massive investment of time. I say this, but I have 100%ed multiple Assassin's Creed's. So I've done Assassin's Creed... Three, no, Black Flag was the first. Black Flag and every other Assassin's Creed after that, up to Origins. I'm currently playing Assassin's Creed Origins, and look, it's a great game, but boy, oh boy, 100%ing the entire game is a challenge. That is a true challenge. Listen to me ramble on as I do some bit of light gunning here. All right, where should we go, guys? Left or right? I feel like left. Left is always the way to go, right? No, no, not right. Left. Nope. Left was a bad choice. Oh! I forget what my heavy attack was. That was my heavy attack. Okay. We've got we still got one guy left with the shield. He's not happy. Lovely. Oh, another guy with a shield. Okay, we've got all the guys with the... Sh oh my god, there's more guys with shields. Lovely. That kind of worked in the... Oh, a heart! Can't say no to another heart. Or two. Hey, that worked out well in the end. Uh, let's perhaps go the other way and see where that takes us. 
more more enemies and mazes this isn't what i signed up for guys i signed up for less enemies ow i signed up for less enemies more destruction okay that i really hope we don't lose any more hearts because we need all the hearts we can get like legitimately need all the hearts we can get at the very least this is a dead end so we haven't really wasted our time here we do have a fair bit of uh of resources now i think we go back and make more bits actually you know what we haven't really found any hostages in, in this map oh boy this is tough okay this this kind of works ow we got hit there but it was all good in the end oh what is that is that another artifact i think it is turns a random enemy enemy into a critter what do we have we've got a tentacle thing i think we stick with the tentacle thing for now i like the tentacle thing oh what are you elegos oh my don't you look elegant Ha, ha. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, crap. What was I? Invisibility again? Ow. Ow. Okay. Um. We've got invincibility. Ow. Ow. Oh no, oh dear, oh dear me. Okay, we've got one life left. This is bad. He's not on much life either. Ow, we've on half a heart. <laughs> We're on half a heart and we died right then. That was close though, that was close. We could have waited, we could have waited a little bit longer for our demon to come back and explode on him, but uh, I just sort of wanted to get that over with. It's good to know our next boss is Elegos. That's good to know. Oh, hello, you're back, but more importantly, let me deal with this. Let's prepare for burial. Where's my A button? <laughs> Don't press X button. Pressing X button on that would be very, very bad. Very, very bad. Let's... Oh, we filled up. We filled out the house. Oh, and you, you thought you are back from your missionary work. I would have thought you. I would have thought you liked another position. Forty-six gold pieces. Look at that. That is good. You, my friend. I would say, can you go to rest? Interact. Sleep. Go to sleep, my friend. Oh, and we've got. We've got another upgrade going on. Okay. Uh, we can do basic decorations. Tabarnacle. Janitor station might be good. Janitor station would be good. I do want harvesting though. I do want harvesting of resources. A harvest totem. Is that it? No. What we really need is probably this. No. That. 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 That's right. Okay, so for the, for the time being, we can fill up by doing some of the other stuff. Um, either janitor station or tabernacle. I think we get a tabernacle. Tabernacle it is, or however you pronounce that. Oh, look at that. That unlocks as well. A shrine flame bundle. Ooh. Light the cleansing fire and harvest more devotion. Or flame, the cleansing fire will draw faith. Okay. Or cheaper rituals. Okay, cool. But I suggest we place a couple of tabernacles down because that sounds like the right thing to do. So much faith. All right, well, some people sleep. We'll go and start the sermon because it's a brand new day. Why not start the sermon? Get a little faith from some of the people. They're looking a little bit faithless and lost. Now, we do need to replenish. We do need to replace one of our guys. That's something we do need to do. I believe we have enough food for everyone at the very least. Oh, a couple of people exploded in happiness. Just a little bit of a, uh-huh, yeah. Uh, let's see, what else, what do we want them to do? 
sustenance, possession, law and order, or the afterlife. Or just work and worship. Let's go with sustenance. A happy cult is a... A fed cult is a happy cult, I should say. Perform a witch ritual that causes all seeds to immediately be ready for harvest. Or perform a ritual that temple which for two days will make special fish more likely to appear. We don't go fishing much. Let's go with the harvest one instead. It doesn't really matter. I don't think we'll be using much of the rituals anyway. But we'll go for the harvest one for now. Because we don't really do that much fishing. Lovely. Everyone's happy. We've got new rituals, new doctrines. I'll leave it at that for now. Everyone's a little bit faithless, but I think once we feed people, they'll be happy. Now we've got decorations galore to put down, like a leafy lantern, for example, which we can put one there, which looks fairly nice. Uh, we can also put down one of these little wreath things, which I think would look great at the entrance. But of course, we don't have the space for it. I do want to rearrange. I do really want to rearrange this. We'll place it there near the curve here. That looks nice. I do kind of want to rearrange how we do some stuff. Maybe put the houses and the um, plots down at the bottom somewhere. And I have to do it sometime in my own time. Oh, these guys are our seeds. How odd. And they're our poop. I think that's even odder. And, oh, that's a lot of poop. We've got fish and wood galore. We've got things being made. Look at that. Lots and lots of things going on. Looks like we need to build another one of these wood things and the rest of them aren't far behind. So let's maybe do that right now. Let's build one of these wood thingies. Um, and I do want to build the wood thingies, all the workshops and stuff up here, right? Up here. And I don't really know how I want to do that quite yet. Maybe I'll put one here for now. Leave that be. So once more get destroyed, I will, uh, I will have to... Oh. I'll have to move everything up here. And we do need more toilets, it seems. Or at least a janitor station so that people can clean up after their own shit. Quite literally clean up after their own shit. We'll, cl we'll collect some of these in the off time. But meantime, let's build one of those tabernacles. Faith. Tabernacle. 20 gold pieces. Okay, that's fine. Uh, what we want to do is build this away, some somewhat away from... Or do we want to build it close to the houses? I think we do. We do want to build it closer to the houses for now. Right? Hopefully it gives us a little bit extra faith. Hello, Sonic. Kale Seller will not give up the games. I'm fear you must take care of them permanently. Sacrifice them. What? Uh, we'll take the quest up for now. We might have to do a sacrifice on Kale Seller. That is unfortunate because we don't have any replacements just yet. Oh, this is really unfortunate. Um, we've got time though. We've got time. So we can we can look for a replacement now and then come back to it later on. Anyways, let's first make some food for the peeps. We'll make some poultry pumpkin soup. Maybe six of that. Six of the normal berry foods. Oh, crap. We missed one. God damn. I can't believe we missed that. We'll have to clean it up once everyone's done eating, I guess. Oh, no. We can clean it up right there. Oh boy, there's spiders running everywhere. You look like you've got something to tell me. There you go. Give me the good stuff. Give me your your, uh, your yogurt. Give me your yogurt. Your, your cult. It's all it's all realistically just your cult that I'm just recollecting back from them. No one tell me otherwise. Nope. Go back to bed. Uh, we've got one empty, one free bed, I guess, but that's not good enough. Anyways, we need more followers. This is a problem. We need, we definitely need more followers. And we also need to perform the sacrifice. That's no good. In the meantime, let's probably head over to the Mentaside Mushroom Forest. Spore Grotto. Hello, people. Who is Sozo talking to when he whispers in the dark? One of the bishops of the old faith is dead. I didn't think that was possible. Oh, why are these? These are floor patterns, rare decorations. Sell them to raise money for mushrooms. More mushrooms, we always need more. You, you are, you what? You are mushrooms. Okay, we're not taking those. What are these? Cards, cards, cards. Oh, more cards. You know what? I'm not taking these either. I'm going to get them for free somewhere. I will have to. Oh, where are we? Look at this place. They've got some mushrooms galore. They've got mushroom on a fire with a clamp. 
and a mushroom in a bottle and follower form it's gonna cost me 20 bucks for follow for follow flat follow follower form um but i'm guessing oh a small mushroom yeah we've got another decoration from an anura a little mushroom lovely all right let's see what this guy has to t talk to me about you don't look like a mushroom, Sozo. Greetings, traveler. Me. Why I'm Sozo, of course. Research of all things mushroom. Guess what makes me a fun guy? Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that got me choking in real life. Just a little joke. Sozo likes to tell. Yes, yes. Mushrooms. Mushrooms are Sozo's passion. But Sozo needs more. Sozo always oh, needs more. You were correct for Sozo, yes? Yes, Sozo can't trust my followers out there. They lie, they steal, they whisper secrets about Sozo. I just know it. Sozo will do anything. I will worship you at your altar. Sozo will devote myself to your cause. I'll rip off your head. Ahem. Sozo will show you how to use the power of the mushrooms to open the fragile little minds of your followers. But you do not need to use your own Sozo, or no Sozo will follow willingly. As long as you keep bringing Sozo mushrooms, Sozo will do anything. Take the path to Anura, find shows of mushrooms. You may not see, have seen them before, but now you seek them, they shall be there now. Okay, so we can give him mushrooms. We've got 91. What will you give me in return? Is the real question. Yes, 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 yes. Give Sozo, give Sozo, give Sozo. Excellent. Excellent. But not enough. Bring Sozo more and Sozo will show you how to brainwash those followers of yours. Sozo suppress. Suppose you want something for your efforts. Of course, Sozo always pays his debts. Take this. Oh, more shards. I think these are the shards that give me more dresses. And more dresses means more hearts. So let's give him more mushrooms. 20 this time. Sozo, I hope this is worth it. Because that's a lot of mushrooms I get to turn to food. Yes, yes, those will do it just fine. Okay, Sozo will share this with you this ritual, but you must not show anyone. Stand back or you will get brainwashed too. It just consumed, he consumed a mushroom and he calls people forth. Oh, wow. Perform ritual at your temple that brainwashes all your followers. Faith will be locked for full, at full for two days. Oh. Oh, okay, I see. I see what this is. This... For those of you watching, if you are underage, please do not follow this by example. Done. As you can see now, Sozo's loyal followers are brainwashed. They will do whatever Sozo says for a few days and lose no faith in Sozo, but afterwards, many of them will fall sick, but oh well. Now that you have seen, you can go yourself to perform the ritual yourself. And it gives me another piece. Okay, so yes. I do not condone any sort of mushrooms and or drug or substance abuse. Just um, do what this guy says. Don't do what he does, okay? Can I give you more mushrooms? I want more pieces. No, we need to do the brainwashing ritual, it seems. So let's head back. Let's head back to our dear old cabin. Our dear old cult. We are back. Lamb Chops is hungry. We've got some stuff as we come in. We'll grab some of this. Halo. That's a lot, but not quite enough. What about you? Receive. Okay, so there's nothing there. People are still milling about with the resources. Lovely. He's up there milling about with resources. But we'll collect them another time. Now, we do have a lot more coin or nuggets, I should say. Uh, but we'll make some and make some stone, at the very least. Nothing can go wrong. We've got so much. Actually, we don't have a lot of wood left. I just realized. We do have a lot of meat, though. So maybe... Maybe we cook more food. Something nice this time. Like fish. And hearty meat broth. This should keep some people satisfied for a longer period of time. Two, one... Zero, lovely. Now, we do not have much more in the way of seeds. And I haven't really planted any flowers, mainly because... Well, I have no use for them at the moment. So there's no no, no possible... Oh, Shizen, what did I do? I planted something. 
I want to talk to this guy and then planted something. Oh well. And I've got another stone tablet. Lovely. That's make that makes it that makes two. That makes two. But alright, we don't have a lot of resources of seeds and stuff. And that's weird because we should be getting we should be getting a lot more. I've prevented him from throwing up. How handy is that? All right, so we'll, we'll continue doing more of the, that kind of stuff in the background, more of the housekeeping type stuff. Let's first have, why are people pooping on the ground outside? This doesn't make sense. Doom. Okay, lovely. Can we build anything in particular? Do we want to build anything more in particular? We've got some decorations going. Uh, we do want, kind of want more of these offering statues. These offering statues are great. Maybe we build one more. We should make maybe two more. Let's make two more, right? They're great. People pr provide a love offering. That's free stuff. If they can provide us free food, I'm not complaining. Oh, crispy bacon looks old. That looks like an old piece of bacon. Piece of bacon, piece of piece of bacon. All right, what do we want? We, do we want more coin? I think coin is the way to go. Meat, maybe. Meat is a bit hard. But maybe first we go back into the depths. Oh. Shoot the projectile. I like this. Let's shoot projectile. And shoot cooldown re decrease. Wonder what that means. Anyways, our base is coming up coming up nicely. We need to kill Kale Cell. I just remember we had that side quest. I wonder if we're ever actually gonna do it. We do need to do that ritual though. Let's hold the sermon. We might have to do the mushroom ritual, but I do not have anything that would that would make people not so sick afterwards because we need the economy still up and running right i think the aim of this game at the moment my new goal is to get the economy up and running making sure that we get people happy so maybe we do a sacrifice of the flesh ritual because we've got to right we, we actually genuinely have to and from memory we had to do it on kale salad so i think if we are correct it's kale salad so sonic doesn't like kale salad yeah kale salad has got to go he seems so happy to be sacrificed oh my lord okay i'm gonna be honest i was not expecting that i was expecting more like a of a julius caesar type thing of a et to brute stop stabbing me in the back kind of deal but uh, it looks like it looks like we did justice. It looks like we did we did just just that. Well, Sonic, can you give me my reward? Because that was that was uh, a little bit unnerving. That was actually genuinely quite unnerving. We've got a quest complete though, which is nice. And what do we have here? It's telling me to do something, but I'm not sure what. Oh, that's right. We've got another crown thingy. So let's get another doctrine in. Oh, we don't have a lot of people left. <laughs> we genuinely do not have a lot of people left. Let's do afterlife this time because we've just sacrificed a guy. Oh, oh, respect your elders. Come on, come on. Let's let's be good. We just sacrificed someone and was a youngin. So instead this time, let's just respect our elders, right? We've, we've, well, let's, let's be nice. Let's be nice. Let's let's genuinely be a nice guy, right? I feel like we kind of need to be a nice guy at the moment. We've just sacrificed. We do not have enough people as is. Can we buy this guy? How much does he cost? Now we can't buy that guy. Okay, well, let's give this Anura. And we start with the Vampiric Gauntlet. Not bad, I must say. Not exactly my cup of tea. Especially since I don't have any red hearts. But they seem to do the trick. They seem to be doing the trick in destroying these dummies. It's usual, right? The gauntlets, I'm not a big fan of them. Kind of wish we can upgrade them, honestly, for more damage or more attack speed. Attack speed works as well. Or you know what? Just as long as they don't keep moving forward, I guess. Oh boy, what did I just do? Okay, I am... I am doing badly. I completely forgot my keys. As in like, 
which button suppress and lost nearly half my life not my life okay okay look we need to focus right we need focus claws are not my favorite i wish we had a decent sword i'm gonna just keep saying that because realistically i would kind of wish we had a decent sword oh starzen that's that means it's clonic hey oh mushrooms menticide mushrooms fun let's draw tarot card oh damages everything on screen receives double health we can't receive health so let's damage everything on scene on screen sorry we got black heart now we can go north or south i kind of want to go north lovely oh this guy does a ton of damage when he shoots okay and this guy shoots with balls ow Okay, he's doing my head in at the moment. Done. Easy. Well, not really. We're back to four hearts at least. But we do need more hearts. Um, that's everything. Oh, mushrooms. I really wish that we got some stone from these. It almost feels like they're taunting us by putting a whole bunch of stones there. Like, hey, give me some stones. No. Um, anyways, maybe we head down because they're genuinely most of these maps will lead at least one of these ways. If there's a choice in two ways, one of the ways will lead you down into a dead end. Okay. Da -ba. There you go. Three hits. Do it. All right, we've got some bones, some grass. Lovely. That's all we really need. We've got a shit ton of grass, to be honest. Look at that, 288 grass. So we'll leave the grass alone. I probably won't harvest as much. Although my OCD is telling me I should have gone back to to harvest that one, one patch of grass that was in the previous map. Lovely. Now I sit, I'm not going to harvest all the grass and I'm still doing all the harvesting, great. Uh, is this the end? Yes. Lovely. So this is stage one. Now remember, we need to try and find as many cult new cultists as possible. When attacked, 10% chance of negating damage. Thank you very much. That's a little bit more survivability, but we want hostages. Okay. Life versus life. Some food. We can go for food. What's that? Coin for food exchange. No, I, I just want I just want more. I want more, more uh, cultists, cult members. But pumpkins are always good. More pumpkins means we can create more food. Amazing. And more food means we can sustain a bigger cult size. Even more amazing. Come on. Give me pumpkins. Pumpkins. Onwards and upwards. Okay, well. Let's go. Here. What does this give me? This gives me like health. Last I saw that gave me was it meant to give me health. Oh, that's what that means. It gives buffs and debuffs. So enemy enemies health halved and receive double damage. In other words, don't get hit. That's what I'm hearing. But we're still not getting good loot or good drops, which is annoying. At least the skeletons guys are pretty easy to kill. Look at that. Easy done. We've got some mushrooms up there. We'll collect some grass. Just a grass, maybe. Okay, so what does that look like? A sword and an axe. Well, you guys by now should know how I feel about axes. It's a vampiric axe, though. Hmm. Or a bane sword. It has higher speed. Bane sword 8. Less damage. Oh. Let's go with the axe. I think we'll go with the axe because... More damage means better stuff, Clonic. How are you doing, Clonic? Let me. Uh, uh, what? Is that like an ultra epic card? I think it is. Attack rate increased by two. We just got an ultra fast axe. Oh my god! We've got the mother of all axes. Holy crap! 
Holy crap! What in the world? Literally just slice through the entire map in basically five seconds. A mushroom pillar. Hey ho! And an amulet of some sort? The flower bloom eternal falls to generate devotion faster. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Uh, let's go back north because we missed a room up here. And that was quick and easy, but we are on two life though, which is a problem. That is a genuine problem and a genuine concern. I kind of wish we had potions. <laughs> Oh boy. Okay. Anyways, that clears out the entire top half. We've got loads, of, loads and loads of mushrooms, which is great. But let's hopefully get through this alive, right? I don't know how we're going to fight the last boss on two hearts. Two non-regenerative hearts at that. And no artifact. I just realized we don't have an artifact. Oh boy, curse has consumed 25% less forever. Lovely. And, oh, did we miss, we missed the, fo we missed the follower, no. Oh, oh, I'm such a spaz. We missed the follower, can you believe that? Why didn't I see, <laughs> why didn't no one tell me there was a follower thing there? Oh, deal damage to all enemies based on the amount of tarot cards you hold. Yeah, sure. One of the gods, now godly power contain eyes and ears, throats and brains. Lovely. Okay, I guess we go out this way now. We're not going to kill all those fleshy doll type things. Because I have a funny feeling that uh, what's his face will not be too happy with us. He would destroy all his friends slash puppets slash things. Oh, what are you? Death Sweep 8. Or Tempest Gauntlets. Yeah, sure, why not? Let's give this a shot. Whatever that is. Uh, I do not like aiming, so that's probably a good trade. Menticide Mushrooms. Look, again, I've been told, however, mushrooms... Sorry, no, flowers are useful for healing. Like healing your troops. Not your troops, your cultists. So, I can't wait to get like a medicine or a hospital or wherever it is to start healing some of my peeps, you know, some of like my fellow cultists. Because if they're going to get sick from uh, from the usage of mushrooms, I better be ready to cure them. Speaking of mushrooms, we're getting lots and lots of mushrooms now. Huh, strange. All right, let's go north, just to make sure we cover our tracks. Holy heck! Secret room. Secret room. Tarot cards, get extra heart. Oh, our first red heart. That's rechargeable. Hey, 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 I like that. Okay, that gives us a little bit more survivability. Spicy Wings has... We've got so many elders. Oh my lord. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, alright. Let's... Oh crap, that hurts. Okay, okay. We've, we've got this, right? We've got this. Oh crap, okay. Lots of flies getting rid of my health. Oh crap. Okay, we are on half a health left. <laughs> Come on. This thing's nearly dead. It has to be nearly dead. Hey, 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 we've defeated whatever this thing was called, Glowion? 
No, Gushon. Gushon was the last guy. Okay, well, we've got a new guy now. What are you called again? We'll figure you out. We'll send you back to base first. We'll figure you out and then give you a name. What do we have? Gold nuggets, stone, or wood? Well, we'll go with the gold nuggets because the rest we can gather our own selves. We've got lots of gold. Look at that. 25 gold and some bones. Lovely. That's done. And that's the second second half of this door that's been unlocked. So we can now return to... Co I've completely forgot I've got an artifact. <laughs> there's a lot of things going on. I love it. I love there's a lot of things that's going on. I just can't remember myself. I am such a spaz when it comes to these, these sort of things. I can't remember that I've got things on hand that I can use. Which is uh, much of a muchness, really. If we can if we can kill bosses with just the basic attacks, I would love to just kill bosses with the basic attacks. Uh, no longer a demon. Lovely. Thank you. We've got some old people and one new person. And we've got lots and lots of defrosion. We've got unlock ability to unlock more buildings. And this time we kind of want the medicine hut. I have a funny feeling that the healing bay will come in real good handy. In real handy. To oh, wait. We should have unlocked this. <laughs> uh, anyways, I feel like the healing bay will be very, very handy when it comes to uh, healing up everyone from some sort of mushroom induced uh mushroom induced coma oh all these buildings got destroyed does that mean we need to replace them i think it does let's quickly do that before i forget and place down the mushroom farm so we'll put the second the second wood hut here and maybe two of the stone huts right after that so maybe we'll stagger them oh we'll maybe do like a v or a c whatever that is whatever shape that is okay we've got some old people we've got uh, now the house that's full we've got not enough seeds for everything oh actually no we've got a whole bunch of pumpkin seeds this is a travesty we need automatic farming we really do we really do need automatic farming at this point look at that there's so much so many things to do so many things to see uh we'll put down the healer's hut as well at some point up here maybe up near actually you know what let's keep everything nice and centralized the healer's hut will probably go here that's that's kind of cent centralized and we'll wait for that to grow but in the meantime I, that's all the time i've got for today thanks so much everyone for watching this is cult of the lamb my name is resolution don't forget to like and subscribe if you like what you saw and want to see more and i'll catch you guys in the next video thanks bye